Abby Connor had only been at Ibero star Paraiso Del Mar for a few hours in January 2017 when her family says hotel staff served her and her older brother Austin tainted alcohol at a hotel pool. Soon after, her family says Abby was found by hotel staff floating face down while her brother was drowning nearby in shallow water. Abby later died at a Florida hospital. Her brother survived. According to the new wrongful death lawsuit filed in Florida and obtained by the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel, the resort knew that alcoholic beverages being served were tainted, substandard, poisonous, and unfit for human consumption. The family is now seeking damages in excess of $15,000. It's been a nightmare. It's horrific. A few months after Abby's death, her mother, Ginny McGowan, warned people about drinking in Mexico. Be very, very careful of what you eat, drink, or you don't know what's necessarily in um, a drink or food. After Connor's death, Mexican authorities raided 31 establishments. They seized around 90 gallons of alcohol being kept in unsanitary conditions. In February, the journal reports, tests found around 235 gallons of a different sea supply of alcohol contained dangerous levels of methanol, a chemical commonly used in windshield washer fluid. They said I couldn't get out of the pool and I wasn't even able to stand up in the pool. Kathy Daly previously told CBS News she believes she drank tainted alcohol while staying at an Ibero Star Hotel in Mexico. They said I was vomiting all over the place and they had to call the hotel doctor. And Daly does not appear to be alone. The Milwaukee Journal Sentinel says since Abby's death, it has received more than 200 reports from U.S. tourists who had similar experiences at luxury resorts in Mexico. We thought we, you know, were safe in a five-star res gated resort, but it's apparent that you're not. Um, and just to warn people that be very, very careful of what...